Hi, I'm Jamie Phillips, this year's president of Ponca City Rotary Club. I'm sorry we couldn't be with you guys in person today. Um, I'm sure you all are as ready as we are to get things back to normal so that we can do all the things that we're used to doing, such as uh, for us, it's serving others. Uh, some of my Rotary friends uh, want to tell you a little bit more about what our club is all about, what Rotary does, how um, it is we serve others, what the dictionary project is, and why this dictionary in particular. We really hope you enjoy our Hello. gift. My name is Richard Winterrode. I'm an architect here in Ponca City. I'm also a member of Rotary International. Rotary International is a civic club made of men and women who get together and discuss what's going on in the world today and also think of ways we can help others. We have clubs all over the world in almost every city in the world. And there happens to be a club right here in Ponca City called the Ponca City Rotary Club. And one project we have at Rotary is to give every student in third grade in the Ponca City area their very own book. And if you look right inside the very first cover is your name is right there. So that means that that book is yours forever. And we hope that you use this book to further your education and help you learn how to read. I bet you already know how to read some and you're gonna get better and better with this dictionary. Thank you. Hi guys, I'm here to talk to you about the importance of your dictionaries and maybe more important, the value of words. Um, a word is just a word until you string it together with other words to make a sentence. And from these sentences, you can do so many things. You can tell a story, you can express yourself, you can recount a history, you can take people to a faraway magical land through a story. Um, all of these things give you the opportunity to get your thoughts across and uh, communicate with other people. Um, the dictionaries will help you with that in that they can give you the tools necessary to build your vocabulary and learn new words and definitions. Uh, use these books to look up words and um, you can find their meanings. You can also find how to use them in a sentence. So uh, we encourage you to use these dictionaries as you go through school when you're writing a paper or maybe when you're reading a story and you come to a word you don't know, go ahead and look it up instead of just skipping over it. Um, look it up and see what the definition is and then the next time that you come across that word, uh, you'll, you'll know it and uh, that vocabulary will just continue to grow. Um, we hope you enjoy these books. They are yours to keep, so please use them as you go throughout your school. Uh, school years and use them uh, to expand that knowledge and vocabulary. Hey everybody, my name is Zach Robertson and I teach fifth grade at Lincoln Elementary and I'm here to talk to you a little bit about this really cool book that you're getting from uh, the Ponca City Rotary Club and it is going to be your very own dictionary. And one of the things that you'll notice when you first get this is that it's got your name in there. So that's your book, it's yours to keep forever. And this is so cool. I got to looking through it the other day and there is on page, uh, where'd it go? Right here on page 373 is the longest word in the English language. And it's a whole page long. So that's pretty cool. And then it's got some weights and measures in here. Looks like, oh, hey, periodic table. Do that in science in fifth grade. Don't tell your teacher, but there's a multiplication table in there too. Uh, there's some really cool stuff. So it talks about the flag in here. There's some civics lessons in here. We've got uh, the Constitution, the United States Constitution. You're going to need that for fifth grade, uh, guaranteed. We teach that in fifth grade. And we also have... All the different presidents in here. This is a cool book, you guys. We need this in fifth grade. So hang on to it because you're going to use this when you get... There's some maps in here. Hey, this is cool. United States map. All the capitals, all the states and capitals are in here. In the back, it's got different countries. All the continents are in here. So neat stuff in here. Oh, man, you can even look. You can even use sign language and braille on the last page there's 
planets in here. This is what we're studying right now. We just started studying planets. So keep this book, bring it with you to fifth grade. You'll have lots and lots of years, good use out of it. And so we hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much for spending a few minutes with us today. I hope it was informative and possibly even maybe encouraged a few of you to join Rotary someday as an adult. Uh, we hope you're going to use the dictionary a lot. Um, I know from probably past years that your teacher may have some ideas uh, for an assignment for you. So uh, good luck. Hope you guys have a fantastic school year. And again, thank you so much for your time.